The ban of about 40 million Twitter subscribers in Nigeria after operators of the microblogging platform deleted a post by President Muhammadu Buhari has continued to elicit passionate reactions from amongst many citizens. These reactions came up on the sidelines of the 2021 edition of the social media hangout, an avenue for stakeholders to have a consistent awareness on the abuse of social media and equally have a better understanding of how it works. Plus, TV Africa's correspondent Uchechi Ugwehi Daniel was there and now brings us the reports. In what seemed like a prophetic gathering, Nigerian youths meet to discuss the inherent advantages of social media platforms in a digital age, as well as issues militating against their use. This comes barely 24 hours after the operation of popular microblogging and social networking service, Twitter, was suspended indefinitely in Nigeria by the federal government. Ace actor and comedian Debo Adedayo, popularly known as Mr. Macaroni, states his grievances on this development. However, veteran Nollywood actor and film producer Yemi Sholade says it is partly a good action by the government. This is a democracy. We are not in a military regime. It's a democracy. So when you have people expressing their views, when you have people expressing their opinions, and then the next thing you say you ban Twitter. Tomorrow they ban Instagram, they ban Facebook, they ban everything. Then let's know we are in full military regime where the people's voice have been stiffened and they cannot be heard. That the Western world would think that our president amounts to nothing on social media. Uh, that, that, that is a huge slap on us, General. not only the president now, all of us. I don't feel anything about Twitter being banned in Nigeria, at least for now. We don't know how long it will take, but I think it's a welcome development. At least there will be a semblance of sanity from that angle for now. Commissioner for Information and Strategy, Lagos State, Benga Omotosho, vehemently corroborates the federal government's stand. I think I read my news very well. I never knew and I never heard and I never saw that Twitter was banned. I only heard of uh, about a temporary suspension, not a ban. So if there is a ban, I mean, what I would say would be different from what I would say if there is a temporary suspension. I suspect that, uh, well, government felt uh, Twitter did something that wasn't right by taking down the president's uh, uh, tweet. And then uh, the, the government to use its power and came hard on, uh, on, uh, on uh, Twitter. However, the majority of Nigerians who use Twitter form part of the most vocal and politically active segment of the population. Uchechi Obwehi Daniel, reporting for Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.